Before we get into some Mega360 chat, just wondering if you guys could do us a massive favour out there. If that's uh, afterwards, just give the give the vid a like, give it a share, and also subscribe to the Fish and Boat Magazine YouTube channel. There's going to be plenty more videos coming through, um, plenty of tips, techniques, uh, gear reviews, all that sort of stuff. So make sure you jump on board. Cheers and enjoy. G'day guys, Booney here with the Hummerbird Pro Team. Uh, today we're talking all, thing, all things Mega360. Uh, it's had me first go with it today, but uh, we'll run you through uh, what I've already learned about it. So, uh, 360 transducer, uh, we've got Hummerbird's bracket that they brought out. So, kind of simple. Unscrew him, flick him around to the side, any position that you want, tighten him up. Loosen him off into the water. Make sure in your manual it'll tell you which way the transducer is supposed to face. So make sure you have that the right way, otherwise, uh, you'll get your images reversed on your screen. So that's in the water now. Make sure everything's nice and tight. And we'll go up and we'll have a look at the, um, at the 360 and what we can see. Rightio, so we got our Mega360 ping off at the moment, so we'll hit the menu, uh, obviously this is on the Helix 12 G3, so you'll need a Mega Plus unit, so either a Helix G3 or a Solix G2, so 360 pinging on, preparing, and away we go. Have a little look at that. Some nice bits of structure and stuff coming up there. The sun's probably being a bit painful there for us at the moment. You see, I mean, you have got Brookie's reflection in there as well, but hopefully we can see see enough. Oh, some nice structure coming up there. Uh, we've got that on 20 meters. Those rings are five meters. So same rules apply. Go to your, your enhancement settings. Sensitivity, you can crank that up, crank it down, contrast, you can go up and down with that and get it to around about where you want it. And what else can we talk about? We're going here, uh, speed, I've got that on speed two at the moment, trying to get some um, some better shots. So you normally can, you can speed that up, if you want to refresh a little bit quicker, three and three and four is probably about it. I think five and six is um, probably a bit too quick. So have that on two. Um, you can isolate your sweep area if you want to. If you only just want to do forward, you can adjust that. I don't want to do that at the moment. So display. So this is a real popular one um, with the bass uh, fishermen over in the state. So just that front view really blows everything up. You can see we've got a lot of big bit of structure here just out to the front of us. Uh, you can see a few little see barramundis in around this area here. Uh, structure, you can see the changes in the bottom uh, hardness over here as well. You can see gravel, rock. Yeah, so this is a um, definitely a game changer and we've, um, we've already had success using it. We'll put that back on full 360. Alright, early days, but we'll, uh, we'll keep going with it. <laughs> 